up everyone? My name is Dora. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm showing you how to make luxurious bath truffles. Truffles infuse the water with moisturizing body butter and fragrance. As the truffle dissolves, the butter melts and the water feels like you've added bath oil. Plus, my recipe has milk powder so it's also a nourishing milk bath as well. It's super yummy. This is a very soft recipe, so you don't have to follow it exactly or even close to get great results. Also, please read the description for the recipe, substitutions, important information, and the supply list. I'm adding coconut milk powder, and oh my god, it smells amazing. But you can add any skin-loving ingredient that you want. Make pumpkin scoops, rose petal scoops, avocado scoops, etc. The SLSA creates foam and lather. The titanium dioxide makes the water white like milk. You can also add butter to the dry mix for extra moisturizing truffles. Tiny chunks or fine powder works best. Use any butter that you want, I used kokum, and melt it. After mixing wet ingredients together, add it to dry. Or, if you're making different colors, divide the batch and add color powder to each. For the color powder tutorial, click the icon. Divide the wet ingredients. This way works best because once wet ingredients are added, you should work quickly before the butter cools. This way gives me time to get my colors just right ahead of time so I'm not rushing, which is a great thing because I really hate being rushed. Then knead the mix with your hands thoroughly. To create a rainbow scoop, add the colors you want visible first. Fill and pack the scoop until it's completely full and make the surface flat. For a solid color with a few color specks, add the main color first and last with a few other colors in the middle. Dry the truffles 24 hours. They're very fragile during this time, but the longer they dry, the harder they become. This recipe makes 12 medium scoops. If you have any issues, please read the common issues section in the description. I only had one issue and it was when using this scooper. The scoops kept breaking and I couldn't get a nice scoop pattern on top, as you can see here. But once I switched to this scooper, the scoops came out perfect every time. I used a combination of eco-friendly glitters. I mixed mother of pearl and cotton candy together. Add decoration immediately after scooping while the truffles are still wet. 
Look how cute they turned out. You definitely don't have to add decoration, but I feel like the decoration finishes them nicely and it adds a nice touch and a little magic. Packaged truffles in a cute ice cream themed cup. The plastic cups are great because they're see-through and have snap-on lids, but my favorite container is the paper cup. It looks just like an ice cream container. The only thing is that the lids don't snap on tight like the plastic cups. Okay, so I absolutely loved these things. I used six the first night. I could not stop myself from adding more. Each one lasts a very long time. The truffle slowly dissolves, creating thick foam and lather as the butter gradually melts. They're fun to watch, relaxing, and they made the water silky and velvety. My skin felt soft, smelled amazing, and wasn't greasy at all, which is crazy considering I used six. It's funny because this week was Teacher Appreciation Week at my son's middle school, and of course, I made all of his teachers gift bags with popsicle ball bars and truffles. Now, normally it makes me really happy whenever I give away my creations, but this time it was really, really hard. Like I just did not want to give them away. I made several recipes and I even made mermaid truffles. You know, it's funny cause I didn't really care for the colors too much until I put one in the water. I mean, I think they're absolutely stunning. After you're left with a relaxing and moisturizing milk bath. Oh my God, I just had an amazing idea. Next time I'm gonna add salt to the truffles. That way it makes a salt soak as well. 